at Music Master 2015 on the Universal Audio booth with Lev, who's going to show us three new Apollo audio interfaces. So, Lev, what's new in the range? Well, we've completely uh, redone the line. We are now showing our next-gen Apollo interfaces. There are three main models of Apollo. Uh, the first is the Apollo 8. It's pretty much the classic I.O. configuration, four unison mic pre's. You've got eight total line inputs, eight line outputs, plus monitoring and headphones. You've got eight at I.O. and SPDIF. Uh, inside the box, we've actually got two different models. We've got a, a dual version with you know, two uh, Shark DSPs and then a quad version uh, that has four Shark DSPs. Uh, you know, that's been sort of the worldwide standard, you know, the classic Apollo. Yeah. And so this has just been upgraded. So everything inside the, in the analog subsystem is completely brand new, next-gen conversion, better specs, better sound quality. Uh, of course, it's an Apollo, so it has all of the major features in terms of real-time UAD processing, which allows you to take all of our plugins, track through them in real-time with no latency. Uh, we also have Unison technology built into the Apollo, which yeah. is our mic preamp technology. We're able to emulate the sound of a Neve or a classic 610 console or an API console right on the input. Uh, of course, these interfaces are Thunderbolt 2, so nice. you're able to connect these to the latest Macintosh computers and get great bandwidth, and of course, you can also run the plugins inside of your favorite DAW. So you get all of this power all in one box. Uh, we've added a new type of Apollo 8 to the line. It's called the Apollo 8P. Okay. And it's actually got eight unison mic preamps. Right, okay. So for the people that want to track drums or the people that mm -hmm. want to do remote recording and actually have yeah. eight mic preamps, they can do this. But the really unique thing about it is it's eight channels of this unison mic preamp technology. So you can have a real mix of all these different types of... Totally. You can have a mix of different types. Or you could just say, I want a Neve sidecar. Mm -hmm. I want an API sidecar or a 610 console. You can really do that in a really nice way with right. the 8P. The third interface in the line is the Apollo 16. So this is our flagship 16 in, 16 out converter best in class specifications and performance. So that's line ins and lines out. That's line in, line out, yeah. plus two monitor, plus AES CBU. All of them are Thunderbolt 2, all of them are dual port Thunderbolt 2, yeah. and they can all be aggregated over Thunderbolt. Okay. So, you know, back at NAM we showed Apollo expanded software, mm -hmm. and it allows us to take any of our Apollos and just make it grow as much as you need. So how many of those can you have in? You can have up to four of them in a system and then okay. a two additional UAD devices if that's what you wanted to build. Right, so satellites. So six total devices mm -hmm. for Apollos. And yeah, satellite would be a great addition. Okay. Uh, but you know, the software is really powerful. You can really get in there and tweak how you're going to have the inputs and outputs show up to any DAW. There's actually presets for any input, any output, and you can even name the inputs. Mm -hmm. And they show up in Pro Tools or Logic or Cubase oh, exactly as you've named them. So really powerful aggregation. And of course, it works with the classic Apollos, and it works with Apollo Twin. So you can actually aggregate all of these devices however you like and just build the system that meets your needs. So it's a really, really powerful thing. Next Gen Apollo, it's the big announcement for us at the show. So also, if you, uh, in terms of the, the Firewire, uh, yeah, Apollo, so thanks that? for that. We have uh, a model that we're also going to be continuing to sell, the Apollo Quad Firewire. And this is really for the people that are connecting to either Mac Pro Towers, for example, uh, or PC machines, mm -hmm. or anybody with a Firewire port. Yeah. So this is uh, the gold standard Apollo. It still works. We're still going to be having it for customers. And the nice thing about it is that, of course, it connects to anything Firewire, but it still has the option slot. So that you decide later, you want to go Thunderbolt 2, you can just slide the it's option card right in and upgrade. Uh, to the Apollo expanded world. Cool. So uh, what are the price points then and when are these going to be shipping? Cool. Great question. So the price points are basically the same as before with the sort of the slot in model. So the Apollo 8 Duo and Quad are 1999 US uh, and 2499 US respectively. Uh, the Apollo 16 is 2999 US and the new Apollo 8P is also 2999 US. Uh, the Apollo 8s are shipping now. They're available today and we're going to be shipping the Apollo 16 and the Apollo 8P in a couple of weeks. Fantastic. Thanks very much, Lev. Thank you.